This video is about how to combine more than two tables together using joins in dplyr. In our last video, we learned how to combine data from two tables using an inner join function. But we often need to combine data from more than two tables. And in particular, in the portal data set that we've been working with, there are three tables. And there are cases where we might want to analyze data from all of those three tables together. To combine more than two tables together, we start by first joining two of the tables together. And then we join the resulting table with a third table and so on until we have incrementally combined all of the tables together. So for portal, let's start where we started last time by combining the surveys and species tables together. We can start by naming this first table surveys species and then assign it. And now we want to use the inner join function inner underscore join parentheses surveys because that's the first table we're joining species because that's the second table we're joining and then our by field so by is equal to quotation marks and then the name of the shared column between the two tables which in this case is species id we can then run this line. We get our two tables joined together. And now we combine this table with the plots table. So we could call this uh, portal full and then assign it the value from inner join parentheses. And now the main table that we want in our join is the one that we just created. So this will be surveys underscore species comma and we want to join it to the plots table. So this will be plots and then by is equal to the field that's shared in column between these two tables, which is the same field that's shared in column between the surveys table and the plots table, which is plot ID. And now if we run this line and click on the resulting table, portal full, we'll see that we have all the information from surveys. We have the matching information for genus, species, and taxa from the species column. And then all the way over on the right, we have the plot types that have been looked up from the plot column. So if we look at plot ID, we see two, three, and two. And those in the plots table correspond to a control plot, a long-term kangaroo rat exclosure, and another control plot. So that's how we combine more than two tables together. We first combine two tables together, and then we use the resulting table and we combine it with a third table. And we can keep doing that until we've successfully combined all of the tables together that we need for our analysis.